Imagine a world where cities crumble, robots rise, and the fate of humanity hangs by a thread. And all of this was created using AI. In this video, I'll show you how to make an entire futuristic movie from scratch using AI tools. Script, image, sound, visuals, and anything in between. Whether you're a beginner or a pro, get ready to bring your science fiction visions to life. The script guides the direction of AI-generated content. It provides a clear structure and roadmap for the entire production. This ensures that the story is well organized and that each scene serves a purpose. You can search to write your own story or get help from ChatGPT or Claude AI. I want to create story about robots that get out of control and attack the city. If you don't know how to start, ask ChatGPT to give you an idea to start your video. I prefer to create images and then animate them to create exactly what I want. I don't want to have a narrator for all the scenes, so I ask it to give me prompts for creating images for each shot. You can also change the number of the characters based on your image generator tools. For the image prompt, I want a maximum of 500 characters. You can change it based on your image generator. I copied chat GPT response into Google Docs to use this file for my generation. For image generation, I use Crea AI. Open Crea website. Sign up with Gmail or email and password. Click on Flux section. For YouTube change the aspect ratio to 16 by 9. Copy the prompts one by one and generate all the images. Download any image you want from here. See Crea different plans. In the free plan, you have free daily generations and you can try other plans based on your needs. Save all the images in one folder and name the images based on your scenes. For some scenes, I use two images. You can use multiple images for each scene. We have some images from previous section and we want to animate them. Open the Halio AI website. Sign in with your Google account. Drag your image here. You can describe what you want to happen or leave the prompt blank to see what the AI does. Try with or without prompt optimizer. It can take some time to get the result, and it depends on when you work with this tool. See different subscription plans. You can also try other AI video generators like Kling AI or Luma Dream Machine. See some of my results. For some of them, I didn't use any prompt. Animate all images and place them in a folder. Name the files based on the video scene. If you need more help with Halo AI, I have videos on my channel about it. Watch these videos. To edit the video, I use CapCut, which is a free tool. You can download this editor and use it on your PC or your phone. You can also use it online. First import all videos here. Then add the videos to the timeline and change the order of the files if needed. I want to remove part of my videos, 
Select the place you want and press the split icon or click on Ctrl and B on your keyboard. So the file is split and you can remove it by pressing delete key. If you want to add transition between your files, click on transitions. You can search for special transition or see different options here. Download each one you want and press the plus icon to add it to your files. You can also change the duration of this transition from here. If you want to add voice to your video, you can use 11 Lab service. Sign in with your account. From the Voices section, go to the Library tab. You can filter the voices and listen to them and find the sound that you want to use. Click on the Text to Speech section. Copy the text that you want to use. Select the sound you want. Press the Regenerate Speech button. Imagine a world where cities crumble. Robots rise, and the fate of humanity hangs by a thread. Download the voice from here. Repeat this process for each part of the video that you want to add voice to. Drag the voice here, or press the import button and select the voice. Put the sound where you want. Imagine a world where cities crumble. You can change the volume. Adding sound effect is an important part. Click on audio. Go to the sound effects section. You can search for the desired effect. Download any sound effect and place it where you want. If you don't know which sound effect is proper for each part, you can get help from ChatGPT. Ask something like this. It gives you the sound effect you need and what you can search to find them. In addition to CapCut, you can use the YouTube audio library and find proper sound effects. You can filter the sounds and find what you want. Another option is the Pixabay website. You can see different categories. Go to the music and sound effects section and search for what you want. Download the sound from here. Do this for all the video shots and collect all the sound effects that you need. After that, import the whole sound in the cap cut. Put each sound effect in the right place and change the sound time according to the duration of your shot. Using AI. If you have any question, ask in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.